show's so good, we won't blame you if you can't pick a favor. Can't pick a favor. SAFM, South Africa's news and information leader. Well, hashtag create movement um, is, is a campaign that aims to bring attention to and start a conversation around decolonizing the African creative economy, starting a new narrative and developing a generation of storytellers, amongst other things. Well, Michaela Hunter is a marketing and communication manager at Fort. She joins me now on the phone. Hello, Michaela. Hi, Shadow. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Tell us a bit about Fort. That's an unusual name. Yes, well, let me tell you a bit about us. So, Fort, we are a creative content and production network. Um, so we do traditional above the line and below the line advertising as well as production. Um, so we truly believe um, in integration and trying to keep um, ideation of a brand idea close to execution. So we have, you know, we have um, our copywriters and designers sitting next to our editors and our animators. So we really are almost a hub of creativity. And that's actually like you commented on um, Fort being an unusual name. And one of our um, values actually is integrity. And the way we look at that is as Fort, we nurture and protect creativity of every person that works with us, that works here at Fort. Um, so, yeah, that's just a bit about us. We, we were founded with a simple vision. We want to make the world a more beautiful place, sharing great and meaningful stories and leaving a positive impact wherever we go. Well, it sounds very democratic what you do, uh, yes. and and I, I suppose that's what lends you to this campaign, um, yes. decolonizing the African creative economy. So, what's wrong with just frame the, the that discussion for us, the African sure. creative economy? So, what they actually looked at. Um, so, we we were we launched our global network um, this past at the events on the second of Feb opening offices in Kenya and Nigeria, and we're also looking to expand further um, as the years go on. And we, we looked at um, actually getting people to stand behind a movement, um, not just to come to an event where it's just about us. And we, we really delve into it and looked at the creative economy within Africa, and we, we just noticed that um, we've got a lot of agencies that are owned by foreign-owned companies. Mm-hmm. Um, and so the wealth actually that is generated here through – you know, storytelling and brands telling African stories, all of that wealth actually, well, not all of it, there are lots of other independent agencies, but majority of that wealth actually flows offshore. Mm-hmm. And we just looked at the fact that um, we've got international voices, especially in the, like the Western world, dictating our agendas, dictating our stories. Um, and we kind of wanted to say, let's stand up and I start a conversation around the fact that we should be, as Africans, and as part of South African, we should be telling our own stories, and we should be, you know, retaining the wealth that is generated within the creative economy and putting it back into our own creative economy instead of letting it flow offshore. So, it's a, I mean, it's a big call, and um, obviously we can't do it alone, and that's why we really also... It is a, the hashtag create movement is as much our campaign as it is anyone who, who wants to get on board with us. Well, that's what I was going to ask you. How do we get on board? So, so um, our first point of call for the create movement campaign obviously was the, was the event. And we had a lot of people that like showed up and have pledged their support. Um, a lot of the celebrities and influencers. And then the most, the next, Step, um, which I'd actually love to chat to you about getting involved in, is as part of um, the invitation to the event as well as at the event, guests were asked to leave um, a personal message of inspiration or wisdom or like a life lesson in, um, in a wor- workbook that we provided with them. Mm. And then when they were asked to donate this back to us, and what we're going to do with these workbooks is we're going to donate them in our um, Hold the Fort, which is our sustainability arm. And we'll have workshops in South Africa as well as in Africa and around the world where we, we actually like sow that into the next generation of storytellers. So for example, if, um, if you would want to get on board, we would get you to write your, your, you know, words of wisdom or your life lesson in this work, in this workbook. And then we would have host a workshop where we'd actually ask you to come in and talk about your, your lesson and your, your, your words of wisdom to the other students and kind of create a workshop around this, whether that be here in South Africa and you physically come or whether we do that in Kenya or Nigeria or even further abroad where we actually like video you, do a video insert of you hosting this workshop. So you're creating a, a family of like-minded people across the continent. 
Yes, so that is that is um, the aim. You know, we've got um, my CEO Shukri Tofi always says that we've got um, the skills and we've got the resources here in South Africa and in Africa. Um, there's no lack of those skills and resources. It's just a matter of actually taking that to the world and creating. I mean, we've got a lot of really amazing people, and other also other agencies and other companies that are proudly um, African-owned, black-owned, independently owned, and it's kind of about getting, yeah, you know, starting the conversation around that and getting us all to just shift, like shift our mindset around around um, the creative economy. Hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm very interested to know who's participated so far, especially celebrities, because yes. I think you need to you need to have um, recognizable names and 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 uh, those kind of celebrities really. That's what you need. Yes. Um, yes. Have, have you got any that are stand out at the moment? Yes. So so actually, um, just a little bit. I'll just give you a little prelude again. Um, at the event, we decided so as part of the Create Movement campaign. We decided that um, we would we would launch a video, and instead of doing like a, a corporate event video, we decided to actually um, make a music video in essence. So we've we've um, we've produced our own song, and the video was then it was filmed live on the night. It was unscripted, and we had um, all of our guests there, including the celebrities, and we asked them to kind of like you know be involved in this campaign video as a show, um, you know, like almost a pledge of support behind. The campaign. So in the video, we've got um, we had Nomzamo Mbata. She's probably um, the most well known. Mm-hmm. Um, she was also the MC for the night. We had um, Taki. She's a really well known um, blogger. We got um, Namuzi. We had DJ Ready D. We had Aisha Baker, Kajal. Um, we had Kim Jade. We had DJ Reason, DJ Duop, um, Anthony Bila. Quite a few. They are all actually in the music video. And then we had. Um, a few of them on the night just there supporting us. And we've also reached out to a whole lot of other um, celebrities that have kind of pledged their support for, for, the, for the campaign, as well as, you know, bloggers and influencers. But, yeah, those are probably – we had um, Masejo Mapanyane. Um, yeah, a whole lot of them have really mm. been – we've had really positive response from, from the entertainment industry, which has been very great. So, Michaela, a very noble idea, and a lot of, you know, a lot of people are thinking, people are woke these days, and, you know, they really are thinking in the same kind of mind space. But yes. I, I find that as, 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 as these campaigns start, keeping traction is, is the challenge. And, you know, you did say that you, you're talking, you open offices in Nigeria and Kenya, but, you know, how do you intend just staying alive and, and, yes. and being a very, relevant. That's a good question. You, you are right. You get a, a whole lot of traction in the beginning and then it can almost seem to die off. So mm. what we've done is um, I think a big part of keeping the traction is these workshops that we will be engaging, like having people that actually wrote in the workbook and donated it back to us is kind of keeping that going forward. Um, I think specifically we'll focus on um, a lot of the influencers and celebrities that have written in the books for us. I think that will help, you know, keep the traction going and having workshops with them hosting it. Um, and then furthermore, we've, um, we're actually doing quite a big international um, media run um, around the campaign, around um, Create Movement and our global network launch. So we're talking to, you know, quite big um, media names like, you know, Advertising Week, Ad Age, um, Shots.net, Creativity Magazine, and all of that. We actually will, myself and our CEO and our Chief Creative Officer will be in London um, next okay. month to talk okay. to them about that. Michaela, hold that thought, because I want to hear the song eventually. Hold that thought. Sure. We'll be back sure. after this. Awesome. It's time for news headlines with Criselda Lewis. Otherwise, with Shadow Twala, see the world from a woman's point of view. My guest is Michaela Hunter, Marketing and Communications Manager at Fort, and we're talking about their campaign, hashtag create movement in Africa specifically. So talk to me about it again. You said just at, at the spur of the moment you guys put together the song, Unscripted, and everybody was in the room was singing. So we had um, some Michaela, Michaela, yes. I don't know if you've moved around. No, can't you hear me? Move again? Hello, can you hear me? Hello? Hi, okay. Try talking Sorry, to me. See the storm. <laughs> okay. Yes, so I was just saying um, with the song, obviously, so we had, um, we, we created the song and we 
at the event, we had three different sets. We had live sets on the night that people engaged with. Um, and then what we've done is so it was completely unscripted, it was filmed live, and then we, uh, it was cut over the weekend, and then the, the campaign video um, premiered on MTV Base uh, on Wednesday, the 8th of February, if I'm not mistaken. I think it was the 8th. Um, and, yeah, like I said, the Create Movement campaign is really about starting the conversation around decolonizing the African creative economy, um, starting a new narrative and really, like, throwing, you know, like, the seed forward and, and developing a generation of storytellers in Africa. Okay, you know, I know the song is not the kind of song we'd play on our radio station, but <laughs> I, I just want us to listen to it uh, a yes. bit. W- what's it called? What's it, does it... It's called Create Movement, and the song is by um, Miles Malone fe- uh, featuring Manyora. Okay, let's, let's listen to the song. Awesome. Get up and move to live or to die. You choose to live on your knees. You lose to die on your feet. I train with creativity. You got they want it. You gotta own what you got. Don't sell it. Longevity for your bang. Don't take it. Next thing you know, you're creative for somebody else. Tell you rock the life they start. Well, your, your, your target market seems to be very young. Yes. <laughs> if, if that song is anything to go by. Yes. But I'm, I'm impressed with something that wasn't scripted and, and you know, just people coming yes. out and, and, and doing it. I think it also shows that how creative people can be when given exactly. an opportunity. Exactly, exactly. Okay, so... so um, Call to action is for all of us to go hashtag uh, conversate, uh, create movement yes. and offer what? So the other, so as the hashtag is um, create movement, but I think the next call to action is actually to go to our website. So mm. it's www.sport.co and you, or you can go to just the, we've got a create movement page um, on our website that has, it has the whole video, the music video, it talks about the workshops. Um, and there is a contact page um, if you want to contact us of how you guys can get involved. So I think that would be the next call of, call of action. So it's force.co.co. And then you just forward slash create movement. Fantastic. Michaela, good luck with the campaign. Awesome. And, Thanks so much, And Sarah. thank you for really talking to it. us, eh? Yes. You yes. take care. I definitely want to chat to you about getting you to maybe do a workshop <laughs> with us. Okay, okay. <laughs> take care now. Uh, that's Marketing and Communication Manager at Fort Michaela Hunter. Young people doing things for themselves and taking responsibility. Hashtag create movement.